All right, let's talk tech. I do not want tech to be the reason that you don't start and don't finish your online program. I know that tech is one of the biggest hangups that practitioners and coaches have when it comes to actually finishing your signature program and getting it ready to enroll clients into. So I'm going to go through the seven tech platforms that we use with all of our clients. I'm going to explain what they, I'm going to tell you what they are and explain what they do so that you no longer have to research and question and ask and have any delays whatsoever in terms of the tech stopping you. Ready? Let's go. First one is, I'm going to get you to create all of your handouts, your supplementary um, program content in Word. You do not need to spend time, energy, money making them pretty because I promise you, you're going to iterate your program content and I want you to just get it done. So I want you to create all of your handouts, your recipes, your instructions, your guides, your checklists, whatever they are, do it in Word, Microsoft Word, and then you can convert it to a PDF. You go save as PDF. It's really that simple. Please do not waste any time figuring out how to make them pretty. It's not necessary. Tech platform number two. The next thing that you're going to need to do is you're going to need to create the content. So after you've created all of your handouts and your worksheets and all of that good stuff, you're going to need lessons, right? You need to teach your people the things that they need to know so that they can do the things that they need to do in order to get the result that you offer. And our recommendation is using Zoom. We recommend that all of our clients audio record their lessons, especially if this is your first run, if this is your first iteration of your program, you do not need PowerPoint slides and the fancy, you know, voiceover PowerPoints. You don't need those. You're going to want to iterate your program and the goal is just get it done, right? And so we want you to script your lessons and you can use Zoom to audio record. If you want to do face to camera, like I'm doing right now, you can use Zoom and do that as well. And so you're going to use Zoom, you're going to shut your camera off, you're going to hit record to your computer, and you're going to audio record all of the instructional lessons and action tasks that you need. If you need to film things like uh, workouts or yoga or anything like that, use your phone, use an iPad. It's fine. It doesn't need to be high production because you're going to iterate the content. I promise you, you will and goal, just get it done. So that's tech platform number two. Tech platform number three is Amazon S3. So if you already have an Amazon account, you're good to go. It's super cheap, it's not expensive, and the reason that we recommend Amazon S3 uh, to host all of your content, so you're gonna upload your Word doc, save as PDFs, you can even upload your audio, you can upload all of your program content into Amazon S3, and the reason that we say Amazon S3 over and above something like Dropbox or Google Drive is because Amazon is a direct download, meaning, that they don't, it doesn't open in Dropbox or it doesn't open in G Drive. You your person, your client, patient clicks the link and it automatically downloads. And so once you're done with your program content, you're gonna upload it all into Amazon S3. Next platform. If you are doing video and you want it to be displayed versus a download, then you would simply upload your video content into either Vimeo or YouTube, and then you'll have to find the embed link, and you're gonna embed it into the membership site hub where your patients or clients are gonna to go to access all of your program content. And so either you can use Amazon S3 and just get them to download everything, or if you want it to play for them, you would need to upload into Vimeo or YouTube. The next one. This is the membership site platform where your patients or clients are gonna go to go through your program. So we recommend ClickFunnels. We recommend ClickFunnels over something like Kajabi or any of those other things because ClickFunnels 
does all of the things that you need it to do over and above just housing your program content. It gives you sales pages and marketing pages and webinar pages and checkout pages. It's an all inclusive platform and it's super simple to use and it does everything that you need it to do. And so once your program content is complete, once you've finished the lessons, the action tasks, the handouts, the videos, all of the things that you need, you then go and put it into ClickFunnels, which would then give your clients or patients login access, right? So they're gonna get a username and password and they'll be able to enter into your content hub and go through the program in the way that you want them to go through it. After that, we need a way to charge people. And so you're able to connect your ClickFunnels checkout page to either Stripe or PayPal. Those are gonna be the merchant platforms that you use. So either Stripe or PayPal, you choose, either one is fine. And then the last one is email marketing. So you need a way to deliver the welcome email to your new client, yay, new client or new patient, yay. And the way that you do that is via email. And so now that we've run through, oh, I forgot to tell you, we recommend Active Campaign. I got ahead of myself. We recommend Active Campaign for a variety of reasons, most importantly, because it allows you to do a ton of automation in a very simple way. And so that's why we recommend Active Campaign over and above all of the other uh, email marketing platforms. So here's how this would look in reverse. So you have a sales consultation, right? And you are chatting with the person and you um, use your ClickFunnels checkout page to complete enrollment. The checkout page is connected to either Stripe or PayPal, right? And then that is connected to both uh, your email marketing platform and ClickFunnels. And so when you complete the transaction, it triggers your email marketing platform and ClickFunnels. And the welcome email, it's like magic, the welcome email automatically gets sent to your new client with their ClickFunnels username and password, giving them access into the content hub where they can now go through your entire signature program. So I know that it might sound like a lot, it's not. There's seven platforms that you need to run your entire online business off of. Um, let me know in the comments down below if you already have some tech set up uh, and what platforms you're using. I really hope this was helpful. I do not want tech to be the thing that stops you. Uh, so let me know in the comments below the platforms you're using or the tech that you're struggling with right now. We'll talk soon. Bye.